Good morning, guys. It's almost 9 a.m. I have to work today, but I work 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. I was supposed to have to work 10 to 6 shift last night and again tonight, but thankfully the director allowed me to be taken off the schedule, so I definitely appreciate that because if he hadn't, um, I don't know how that would have gone. I washed my hair this morning and this little piece right here keeps sticking up, <laughs> so I don't know, but anyways, I thought that I would try to vlog today and I'll try to vlog a little bit at work too if I'm able to. It just kind of depends on whether work is crazy or not, so don't hold me to that. Um, but anyways, I am getting ready to edit a YouTube video and then I need to work on some homework. It's hard working full time and going to school full time, like having a full course load. So I'm gonna try to knock all this stuff out today. So I just got off of a phone call with my boss, well, one of my bosses, and he is taking me off 10 to six tomorrow night and giving me the day off because technically I would have worked six days and he only wants me to work five because he's like, even though I appreciate how much you want to help us and work, um, we don't want you to get burned out. And he's also, from the sounds of it, he sounded like he was going to be taking me off of the 10 to 6 schedule for good. Um, so then I would only work 10 to 6 if I either got mandated from working a 2 to 10 shift and somebody didn't show up or if I picked up those hours. So from what it sounds like he's going to do, it sounds like he is going to um, take me off that shift and schedule me for either 6 to 2 or serving hours, which is 7 to 3.30. So um, I guess we'll see how this goes. He wants me to come in and talk to him when I come to work this afternoon because um, like I said, I'm covering for Deja, who works from 2 to 10, but she has a funeral to go to today, so I'm working for her, and then, like, he just, he said he's making the next schedule, so he's gonna, he wants me to come in and talk to him about next week, because they have too many people on the schedule for night shift, so, like, for night shift, they only need three people, and on every single day that I'm scheduled to work, there's four, so I don't want to screw with anybody else's hours or anything like that. So that's why I had messaged him over the weekend and told him, you know, if you need me to work six to two or cover more serving shifts in the dining room, I can definitely do that. So he wants to talk to me about that when I get to work and then talk to me about the next schedule when I go to work also. So it's now 3.38 and I started my shift at two, got all the scheduling stuff. Um, worked out and now I'm just kind of waiting for dinner service because when you come into work here um, there's not really a whole lot to do until like dinner and then after dinner there's kind of another break um, while you're waiting for people to decide that they want to um, go to bed so that's kind of how things are going here and I will try to remember to check in with you guys if I can. Um, like I said, it kind of just depends on what's going on.